Hello guys, and welcome back. We were last left off, uh, the power's out, and I just shot a bunch more zombies, and my axe broke. And I think that's the gist of it. Yep. I can't see anything. Okay. Let him have something to eat. We'll have a... A bottle of mayonnaise? No. Some... Corn. Yeah, we'll grab one. Eat half the corn. That will be your meal. We're gonna have corn. You know, uh, like... Was it hearty appetites or something? It's not actually that bad. Late game it is. It, it can be really bad. Or like mid-game, I guess, when you're out of supplies that you've looted. You know, like, um, when you've looted all the fridge and the power was out so you can't store them anymore. And before you have a farm to make sustainable food. That's when it's bad. But early game it's good because, well it's not good, but it's okay. Because you have an excess of food. Like I have. And I've only looted like one and a half streets. And then late game, you know, hopefully by then you're growing enough food to just live. And it pretty much just requires two meals a day, about. And that's just one item. Sometimes it's just one thing. I eat half a, a corn, and then I eat another half a corn later. God, this is his life! This is Merrick's life now! <laughs> he runs down the same zombie-infested street as he tries to get up here. Okay, we're... I think I've decided something. In that, ble in that brief second there. I think I've decided my next strategy. We're taking back the highway. Which kind of involves, um... A lot of bullets. And certainly... A lot of bullets. Maybe not so much an axe. Oh my god, I've got... I'm over 15 in weight. Each bullet weighs like... A lot of... A lot! Uh, put in a box. What? I have... I have boxes? And that severely reduces the weight. Then what, then I open the box? I don't know if I just sacrificed a bunch of ammo there. Um, we'll have uh, the axe equipped for now till we get to the highway. I'll just take down the zombie. Hello? Okay, we'll get to the highway, then we're pulling out the pistol. And go in, uh, go in a bit crazy. Yeah, there was nothing, nothing in there, in their bodies. Normally it's infested with zombies. So we're gonna see how that works out. Oh, some vending machines down there. Okay, I can make a quick detour to go see what's in there. Maybe a school bag! I do want my blade skill up as well, so kind of uh, a reason to keep. Oh, ah! I'm sorry, it's yours. Not no, not me, not me. God. Okay, where are they? They're over there. I'll get the crisps and the pop later. Looks like we're just going straight along with uh, the extermination of zombies. Yep. Okay, stand still. They're dead when the brain splatters. 
That is how you tell a dead zombie. Okay, he's out. Might be a bad idea, because I do have most of my ammo in boxes, which I don't know anything about. As far as I know, it just reduces weight. Thank you, God. There's a God up there. Despite what anyone says, there is a God up there. And he is watching out for Merc. That was it! That was the entire... everything that... Her uh, yeah, heard to me. It's a wedding rim, we'll take that. More bullets? Yeah, we're doing fine. Let's go check out um, the vending machines. Should I take this off and like store it? Okay. Grab some crisps, grab some pop. These are actually necessity items now. Yeah, I'll just leave it to that. Hell, if you break down the door, I got a plank. So. No harm really done. I'll uh, eat the corn. Okay, let's go to this highway. The cleansing has begun! <laughs> Let it be my death! As it'll, it will inevitably uh, uh, be. Yeah. I'm sure I can keep finding ammo on these zombies. The lucky trait is not bad, I have to say. He's out. Always looking out, listen out for that click. Cause that means a horde is uh, descended upon him and you're probably screwed. A lot of zombies! How did you hit that zombie? Do I take the aiming skill? I guess I do! Because I'm not doing anything else! Repair a pistol? It's fine at the moment. Don't see why I would need to repair it. I up your aiming skill, and you do worse! How does that work? Okay, we'll have... one of these boxes. Okay, like, okay, yeah, that's how it works. Yeah, that's actually really good. I might start uh, packing up my bullets like that. It's good for two reloads. God, I have never gotten to a point where I could do a cleansing run. This is amazing! I imagine so many people are saying this is a terrible idea, and I would agree. Splatter's brains on the wall there. He's out. This is why I got a pistol! I said a cleansing was gonna happen in Muldrow, and my, by god, it's gonna happen! Besides, I'm finding all the ammo I need on the way. So... He's really scared. Uh, that's probably reducing his accuracy. I'll have the beta blockers out just in case. And take one. That might be the source of some of the problems. Okay, oh! I guess, uh... They thought so too, because they're giving me another one. Look at this. I'm saying to everybody, pick up the lucky trait. Because this is just amazing how much ammo I'm finding on these zombies. Maybe it's just Merrick. I guess it's just... Or the, the divine god that's looking out for him. 
I know I'm missing ball, it's uh, not the time to really be doing that points game. Okay, what do we got here? You son of a bitch. Yeah, might as well get out of here. The books are not worth it, I have to say. Hmm, while they all go for the, uh, the store... <laughs> this is my time. Do not blow yourself up, Merrick. I don't want to shoot that zombie. <laughs> what the hell? How I didn't want to shoot the zombie, so what does he do? He does it from the side. I guess he's just so good at aiming, he just hits zombies. We might actually get to that warehouse. No, probably not. There's always zombies in the way. I must get past them. I'm almost out of ammo. At least the ammo I brought with me. I'm pretty sure I got another like 50 or 60 bullets back at home. But by then I'll probably be swapping back to the X. This is just for today, folks. Get some good Gun action. I wonder how many zombies I've killed. I'm not gonna search. Well, check right now. I'm moving into another street. I don't want to do that. I'm gonna have a lot of bodies to search. Now I've got you. Okay, up the road I go. Let's see if I can just sneak by them. There's Knox Bank. Ah. Wasted a shot there. Okay, Spiffos, it should be right up there, but I am going home. I'm retreating, I know I've overstepped my boundary here. Yeah, I'm out. And I am out. That's all my ammo. Okay. Merrick, you've done well. No matter what anyone says in the comments, you've done well. How many zombies? 405. Nobody can say that's a failure. You can say you've wasted ammo, but what else was I going to use ammo on? I'm going to kill one zombie, because then they have a skill point. Where is a singular zombie? I'll find one. Oh, hello. There we go. I have one in reserve now. I better get home before it gets dark and zombies kill me. There's already a zombie over there. <laughs> At the start of this episode, Merrick had 200 zombie kills. In three episodes, he has doubled that. And then some. Well, uh, when you get home, there's gonna be a nice meal. Of what uh, has been, uh, what hasn't rotted in the fridge, that is your meal. I need to find a shotgun at some point. Okay, we'll put this away. We have uh, had a successful supply run, I think. We've got. Some magazines, we got a few more chips, and some pop as well.
chips are gonna stay with America at all times, you know, emergency food, he gets stranded outside, you know, his safe house, he's gotta have some food. Okay, but I did... No, I'm being paranoid. Uh, I did say I would go search the doctor's office, so... I'm gonna leave that horde up there. You know, I'll do the looting some other time. I might do it in this session. Uh, we'll see. I did spend a lot of time just going around killing people. Uh, we'll have a fresh onion. Enjoy, Merc. Half an onion for you. Don't you feel so lucky in these times? Okay, we'll try and put away what we can. The onion is going to stay with Merc. Put the magazines away. I don't want to go to that um, gas station because that had books on carpentry, an expert carpentry. So I will want to go there. I can't really read it, but, you know, I can, I can have it. Still no sign on that saw, though. Uh. Anyway, that's the end of this part, folks, so thanks for watching. And in the next part, I guess we go raid the doc's office, possibly go for the bookshop, and the rest of the zombies. It's probably just going to be looting next episode. So, see you then.